Hi guys, so I'm going to focus a little bit more on content creation and that includes uh, trying out some YouTube videos. So this is one of my first ones that I'm like taking seriously. Um, the other ones are probably just for like posting to other platforms like my blog. But this one I'm using my actual camera, so yeah. Um, I wanted to talk about losing my job and I know that's something that's super relatable right now because um, a lot of Americans and people all over the world actually are losing their jobs but um, yeah I think that it's something that's a little bit different for me because I am not I am here in California and I'm originally from Texas so I wanted to talk a little bit about um, my journey here so far and yeah just about stuff like that. So I graduated college. I'm from San Antonio and I went to Texas State University. I graduated with a bachelor's in public relations, mass communication, and a concentration in business administration. So after that I went for a summer internship in California which turned to a social media position at a PR agency and after that I kind of went back to step one and did another internship at a showroom because I had no idea what a showroom was and I had to get my feet wet and learn about the industry and how a showroom works so I did that first which is kind of weird taking a step back and then getting into something else but that's kind of how I feel like I learn best building a foundation and then building upon it. So after that uh, internship, I went on a lot of diff different uh, job interviews and I got one at a different showroom as a fashion uh, assistant. And then I ended up managing accounts, which is kind of what I wanted to do in the first place. So I was really fortunate about that. And I love the people that I worked with and they were super helpful and taught me so much. Um, gained a lot of valuable friendships and learned about the industry. Um, in a showroom you not only work with the brands that you represent, which could be uh, a lot of different brands from like streetwear to like ready to wear, stuff like that. And you have to get them placement and editorials and celebrity placement is mostly what we focused on. Um, also you can do like influencer gifting and stuff like that, but it just depends on what the brands want and what they're looking for. So, um, I did a lot of PR stuff for different brands and I loved it. That's kind of like what I want to end up doing. And it's just like really crazy to, if I'm being honest, to be let go because it's something that like I didn't realize that I wanted. Now that I do know about it, I do really want to do that. And I think what's next is just going to be a lot of like freelancing and stuff to hold me over until I can apply for uh, jobs in the same capacity or higher. And during this time, I think I'm just really going to, you know, up my game and learn a little bit more. One, about the industry. Two, about, you know, being more creative and pushing what's going to separate, you know, a brand that's just starting off between, you know, like a higher end, um, you know, either boutique or higher end, like brand that's already more established and what's going to set them apart. So I think that's something that I'm going to be doing over um, this time. Also going to be working a lot on content creation, which is kind of what I'm doing now, obviously. So I'm going to be expanding all my channels, um, improving my media kit to include like some of the stuff that I incorporate with work and then just so it's an all encompassing package. Um, the only thing that this really affects is whether I get to stay here or not because I obviously have no income now and that's you know really difficult because even though I eventually wanted to go back to Texas I wanted it to be on my terms and when I was ready and I don't think that I'm quite ready yet and I feel like to be at the beginning of something you want to progress and I need to be here to progress in all aspects whether that be content creation or um, fashion PR stuff 
So that's kind of an update on my journey and where I am right now. I know it's really hard, but it's something that like a lot of people are struggling with right now. So you just kind of take it in stride and be thankful that if I had to be let go, it was now. Um, I'm really thankful for the people who've contributed to my journey along the way from my first um, supervisor and my very first internship and social media position to my co-workers and my last position so it's just something that like you grow from and you keep going and you keep fighting to figure out what you want and that's kind of where I'm at right now but yeah we'll see what God has planned for me talk to y'all later